Hiker Jay here. This week, I'm gonna level with you. That's right, sharing with you Lynx levelers. Levelers for your vehicle when you're camping out in your vehicle, overlanding, whatever it might be. I really struggle with that because it's always cockeyed and I sleep in the back of my Jeep, which I'll show you. But these Lynx levelers are awesome because you can put different setups on each tire, different heights so that it can get it perfectly level. Now I bought the set of 10. You can check the description down below. They have smaller sets, but I like it because I can put spread out the weight a little bit more on something soft like this so it doesn't crush in or i can go with less like i do on the concrete i'll show you that too i'll show you how they hold up on concrete because sometimes i really thought these would kind of crush uh on concrete but i stack them up multiple and, and go through that and i'll show you that in just a minute now i keep them up in my cargo box up there uh, i keep five of them up there just so i have them all the time but if i know that i'm going camping i'll take the rest of them the bag right here so lynx levelers this is the case that they come in it's pretty sweet i got a set of 10. Uh, as you can see this is how i sleep in my jeep i have this platform back here and when it's not really level like right now it's kind of leaning off to the right and back uh, it's not the most comfortable thing as well as pulling out my my cooking setup when that's not level you know you put eggs in a pan and they just go all over the place so levelers become really important there's something that's really simple so first i'm going to level out here on like a softer dirt and i'm going to put a couple more here because the jeep is kind of leaning to this corner and less over on that side and you can see how they compact let me go ahead set them up and back the vehicle over them for you now the way that these work they have this octagonal type setup where you can put them all together i kind of like that because you can really spread out the weight this way now if you're on concrete i did find that you can just stack them up by twos and get right up there but if you're on dirt or something like this I'm gonna wanna go stacking it. So I'm gonna go all the way up to three on this side and then only two stack on that side. So this still leaves me one left over if I wanna put one on the front corners if I need to. So let me back up on here and show you how it works. All right, now you can see I've got three stacked high, two over there. That one I nailed perfect. This one I'm totally off to the side, but it's still not crushing or anything. I think that's good to show that all that weight's on that one side. Um, if I was staying out here for the night, I would certainly straighten that out. But as you can see, the tire even smushed in right there. So these did not crush in. I was worried they would really crush in, but having all that weight distributed across, I think is, is really, really good. And now looking at the Jeep, it's really level. This is great because the ground really slopes that way. But now I'm really, really uh, level here. And look at this, I don't hit my head on my hat or anything. That's a big one too, is getting to the back of the Jeep, especially when it's off like that. Uh, and big thing is that this is nice and level. I really like that because it wouldn't have been too bad kind of leaning that way, but I think I would have slid. So having this real level to sleep is perfect. All right, now let me show you how these work on concrete. So I set them up and I just did too high here to see how it would climb up on it and grip for the concrete. And you're gonna be able to see, see here, it's just, it works just fine. Climbs up there, no problem. Um, you do have to kind of find that sweet spot when you put it in park because it can kind of coast forward. Uh, but I got it pretty good and I'm pretty happy with how it worked out there. And so this is one of them that was on the concrete and scraped on the bottom there. You can kind of see just a little bit uh, shaved up there, but no crushing across here, no problem. I mean, you can definitely see that the concrete, you know, scarred it up a little bit all in these places, but that's nothing when it comes to the weight of a vehicle crushing down on something like this. I so often have gotten just like logs and things and shoved them under there. This is so much better. And the fact that five of them fit up there in my Rome kit, that's pretty sweet. And when I'm going camping, I'll just throw the other ones in here as well too. So that's a real quick video on these levelers. I love them, super cheap. Everybody should have them in their car camp and set up just to be able to level things out. Like I said, I'll put the link down below so you can get them yourself. Till next time, just remember, life's a hike. So hike happy and make sure you sleep nice and level when you're car camping. Take care.